Stay a while and listen. Hello, welcome back to the Freak Show. Bumpy McSquiggums here. I want to thank you all for joining me as I continue with my Let's Play of Disgaea 1 Complete. This is our new game plus other extra stuff, bosses, and all sorts of other things mode. It's fine. We played through Edna mode. We played through Disgaea 1's main storyline on Disgaea PC. And this is just the continuation of the game. So, it'll, it'll look a little different from Disgaea PC to Disgaea 1 Complete, but... Yeah, it's it's fine. All right, let's see how the Cave of Ordeals Demon Hall Mirror goes now. Cause I'm sure there's more terrible things. This place again? I didn't think there were many who were stronger than that red hair. Are there? That doesn't sound yeah. good. Prince, something's coming. Uh huh. It's Rosalind. A girl. A girl. <laughs> she is pretty busty. Uh, Not the kind of girl that you're into. She looks kind of mad. That powerful aura. She's no ordinary debutante. <laughs> Very well. She's a worthy opponent. I, Laharl, will make her kneel before me. Uh huh. Okay. 20% recovery, enemy boost times three, and no lifting. Oh, you were just making this really. Do oh, God. He's there, too. What? Uh, I don't think we can do this. I'm going to say there's no way we do this. Yeah, there's, there's no way. Huh. 3.5 million. 1.4. I'm like, we can kill him. Probably. Uh, can't kill her. Okay, so this looks like this is a thing that we're gonna have to come back to. But, just to, to show that we've tried. Oh, man. Um. Wait, we can get rid of the recovery one pretty easily. But I don't think, see there being a way that we can hold both of them down. That's This is going to be a tough fight. I'm not going to lie. This, I don't know. This is by far the, the toughest fight that we've experienced. Uh, and I, granted, I didn't even try to fight Overlord Zeta. Overlord Zeta did not, uh, did not go down at all. Hmm, no, my, my, it won't, it won't reach. I'm sitting there thinking, I'm like, maybe... If we do this, one thing... No, it's not going to happen. This is the boost. This is the lift. Oh, boy. All right, well... I guess we'll try it for uh, the lulls, but i 90% sure that we die a horrible death on this. I do not see us surviving in any way, shape, or form. Like, no one's close. Like, you know, if they were like 3,000, maybe, maybe they'd be okay. Probably even like 2,000 or 2,500. But, like, they're they're fighting way above their pay grade right now. And they're doing it. Oh, God. I haven't seen numbers like that before. Yeah, no, this is, uh, that's it. It's, it's over. But that's fine. Like I said, we're still gonna, we're gonna see what we can do. We see how strong they are in like normal mode here. Oh no! Oh, you you weren't strong enough. No, no, that's not that's not how it's supposed to be. Go away! Oh god, he can't even hurt her. Well, again, he's he's over he's over two thousand levels lower than she is. More more than two thousand levels lower than she is. Can Laharl hit her? Ha! Nope. 
Ooh. Ooh, boy, howdy. She do some damage. I feel like he's getting the better. <laughs> How many counters was that? Was like 75 counters. What was that? That was insane. Well, the lifting problem's gone. All right, we got this, don't worry. We're gonna bring out the one true superhero slash villain. We're gonna puke on her with Party Commissar. Nope, didn't work. We did. 41,000, that was it, oh no. All right, let's group it all up. Let's get this done. Let's have people that we don't care about die. Uh, and Commissar. Probably should have clarified that at the beginning. That's, that's fine. There it is. Well, that's not a thing we can do for a while, guys and gals. So I think that might be the end of that little chain of events. So, scary times. Let's go do something else. Where would I like to go? Well, uh, you guys want to see what's in Beauty Castle or the alternate netherworld? Since you can't answer me, I want to see what's in Beauty Castle. It's a foreboding seal. Hold on. 65. This is 56. Eh, it's still going to be tough. Let's go there. What? There's no cinematic? Oh, okay. Ooh, a rare Amon Force. I want that. What do you got? A Belial Force. Yeah. Shield of, of Aegis, Infernal Cape. Yeah, I, I kind of want that. Alright. So, this should be pretty straightforward, I would assume. I mean, sure, they're going to still do some damage, and it's going to hurt, and people are going to cry. But they're nowhere near as strong as the last group that we just fought, or got murdered by, I should say. I wouldn't really call that a fight. Like, that was just a stomp, and we, we just got we got slapped upside the noggin and made to look foolish. It was, it was pretty not good. That's okay. That is okay. We're, I'd say we're good at pretty not good, but we're not. We're actually very sad. All right, execute. Um, Slade, I guess. We'll sling you over there. Bring Antros and Laharl back out too. I think they can still be viable, sort of viable in this. Antros way more than Laharl, but that's okay. Laharl has a cool axe. We just need that for like, I don't know. Let's see what kind of what kind of phrasing will we call it. Um, moral support, I suppose. Emotional support. Fine. All right, so let's uh, let's use. I haven't seen the rising dragon yet, guys and gals. So let's go see what that looks like. I've used the skill, never seen what it actually looks like. I think you punch them around the world. Maybe I have seen it. Maybe I even showed it to you guys. I don't know. But yeah, we, we literally punch him across the planet, and then he ends up behind us. Pretty sick. You know, world ending events here, it's, it's no big deal. Alright, Knight Sever on you. Bumpy, come on down here and do the same. I mean, that should kill him. Probably. Storm on you. There we go. Move down here. Let's over again. And you get to go up against a big giant fiery guy of doom there. And you're going to steal his thing, his uh, weapon. Ooh, his faith, too. Some more hit we can take. Alright, we got his Amon Force, so he should be sad now. Alright, end the turn. Was not enough damage. They're still okay. Ooh, someone died. Who died? Oh, he killed his own guy. Oh, okay. Well, that's not that's not very nice. 
See, that's the problem with these evil overlords. They're killing their own people off. I mean, I do it occasionally, but we'll pretend it's accidental. That way I don't look so bad. Alright, let's go ahead and get rid of this dude now. Antros, you did stuff. You were you were around. Oh, I forgot somebody. Nope, he's over there. I'm like, I forgot to bring out Kalark this whole time. Nope. He's just chilling off to the side waiting. He's just patiently sitting there. He's like, whatevs. I know you'll get around to me eventually. He's starting to outpace everyone. I'm going to have to switch his item soon. Alright, let's execute. I think the castle might be outside of our uh, range of things to do, too. I mean, like, this first level seems fine, but if there's, like, a multitude of levels, which I'm going to have to assume that there are, I think we're going to be in trouble. Because this one's uh, not, you know, the end-all, be-all of everything, but it's it's pretty good. There's some damage going out here. We just 114, and I got the kill. Nice. Ooh, we unlocked a Prometheus bow. I don't, don't, don't think that's very special. We keep getting super bonuses, too. I don't know what that means. Ooh, 62. That looks like that's going to be... Mm, again, outside of our realm of possibility. But maybe. Maybe we'll be able to do it. All right, before we hop in and try that... Commissar, remember how you just got that cool weapon and you're all like, Yay, I got a new weapon. I'm super cool. Guess what? We just got a better new weapon. You're even more super cool than you were before, buddy. See, I'm taking care of you. I'm giving you the best of the best of the best, sir. A graduate with honors and all that stuff from... Who was that? Poor Flan. Um, movie, 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 movie. Men in Black, the original one, I believe. Alright. So there we go. Eventually, Zombasar will come around and become... Uh, yeah, a bigger force in our in our group. Maybe maybe not the the end all be all force, but a bigger force. All right, let's go see what the second part of Beauty Castle has to offer. Beauty of Evil. Hmm, this energy. Who's there? Show yourself. Okay. Who the heck are you? Uh, a woman? Yeah. Don't let your guard down. She's strong. Using all that makeup to hide her wrinkles. Defying gravity with that push-up bra. Wearing such a skimpy outfit at her age? It can't be. The most malevolent witch in the entire galaxy. That's true. And this is a golden opportunity. We'll see which one of us deserves to be called the most malevolent... Okay. Who? Who? Hmm. I'm worried. I'm definitely worried. Oh, good. She has friends. She's got Frank, and she's got Magnus. I don't think that's anything special. No. What does she got? She's Marjorie. I have no idea who that is. Oh, good. She's level 2500 as well. And a witch, which means she's probably going to cast a lot of horrible spells and destroy our souls with those horrible spells. Don't think we can handle it, but we'll see. I don't know what a Nyanko soul is, but it's a rare. Same thing with the Gale Guts. Gale's Guts and Crowdia's Beauty and Meow's Cat Ears. Well, I, I think, like I said, I think we're, we're doomed here. This is not going to end well for us, but... I mean, no, not you, Edna. You had your day in the sun. You were the strongest once upon a time. That ship has sailed a while ago. Hmm. I'm going to lob you over here, and then I'm going to have you do this. I mean, that hurt him, but... Uh, not enough. Kind of hoping we could snipe the two dudes on the sides. Let's call it a day, but I don't think that's going to happen. It might. It may happen, but I doubt it. Alright. Well, let's get Bumpy over there now. Let's see what he can bring to the table. 
I mean, it's possible she's not super strong, but I don't think that's true either. Alright, you know what we'll do is I will do it this way. Do the dimension slash this way, and then we'll move. Oh, we only hit them, okay. We still gotta do 39,000 on this side and 42 on that. Okay, um, I think the robot's gonna have to do some good stuff here for us. I feel like I'm probably wasting a bit of time doing what I'm doing right now. Because in reality, I, I really don't think we have what it takes to end you. Oh no, I don't have enough of these either. But at least we'll get to see what she has to offer. Alright. Oh, oh no, I didn't look at what our chance to steal was. Wasn't it 99%? Crud. Well, that didn't go well. Um... Oh, we got Captain Gordon somewhere down here. Where are you, Gordon? And... Calark. Captain Gordon, Defender of Earth. Come around the backside of this and do a Night Sever and me. No, 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 no. Alright, let's see what happens. Oh, boy. You meleeed us? Oh, God, what did you do to... Uh, hmm. No, you're asleep. Oh, that's not... No. Uh, where are you? Where are you? Where are you? There you are. suppose you can cast Espoir that far. Dang it, no. Alright, that's why we kept Gordon and crew around. I mean, you're gonna die for it, but... Did you kill your other per Yeah, I... Hmm. Alright, so we're gonna execute this. I'm gonna try this again. I could've sworn I said 99%, but I honestly wasn't... Oh, we have a 0%. Alright, we're too low of a level for any thievery above, like, maybe 2,000. Or, yeah, 2,000. Okay, well, that's good to know. It's also possible that we can't... I, I looked at the romance and saw the 99%. It's also possible we can't steal from her. That's a possibility, too. Like, I, I knew that wasn't gonna work, but I'm just saying... Like, in general, that may be the reality that we're faced with here. Yeah. Did not do much. Um, okay, so... Ha. Dimension Slash... Not really a way I can do this, is there? I'm trying to figure out how to how to kill this guy off without like and without moving really is essentially what I'm trying to do. I don't think your Terra Star is even strong enough to do this. Did something. I, like that's more than I thought it was gonna do. Well, I threw with you, didn't I? Eh. I mean like I can I want to trap her is what I'm wanting to do, but it's whatever. Don't have to trap her, I guess. It's fine. I, I mean, like if it looks like it's viable, like we can maybe do it. Maybe I'll try it again, being a little bit better prepared, but I, I don't think so. So it looks like we're going to be going for the end of each of our, uh... Well, that's frustrating, I guess. Why don't we not do that? Why don't we do this instead? Robot. Come on, robot. Uh, 
Yeah, I, I'm very curious. I don't know, but I, I have my suspicions that maybe her items are not stealable. But again, it's she's over a thousand levels higher than me, so that's also possible. But I was able to steal from level 2000 Amon at 99%. You'd think if it started to get to the point where it's risky that they would have uh, started to lower the percentage. Like if I wasn't going to be able to do it. So, a little questionable, I guess. I'm going to try for the heal. It's more on to you. Some big hits. I mean, it kind of looks like we could almost do this. I don't like that she keeps putting him to sleep, though. It's, uh, hmm. I don't know. Does she not have pants on? Nope, just, just sleeves and... Okay. Yeah, sure, no, whatever. So, what I think I will do before we try to take this on for realsies is I'm going to probably end up having to... I level up her healer a little bit because obviously we're going to need slightly bigger heals and hopefully our healer will be strong enough to survive like actual magic attacks of doom can't guarantee that but maybe maybe that's a thing that can happen and then beyond that who knows um gotta get my healer or, i'm sorry my thief up to probably we'll say 2000 and probably the the the, the deadly trio of doom so the Fatal Four will be essentially around 2,000 is essentially what I'm looking for here. Because it does look like this is viable, like we could do this. Oops. Um, but unfortunately, we're not going to do this, so I'm going to start murdering my own people now. And hopefully that's fine. And I'm going to group up everybody as well, and maybe she will actually go ahead and do the damage to us herself. I'm gonna I'm gonna add to that a little bit though. Essentially we want everyone dead. That's that's the goal. There you go. You're getting it now. You're getting it now. So we will do winged slayer this way. Uh, I guess we'll do winged slayer this way. And then back this way. She gets to go and attack. I hope we don't accidentally kill her. Oh, wow, she just murdered 70,000 damage with that one. What was that? I mean, it was good, but dang. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that didn't quite go. I mean, it, it went about uh, what I expected. Uh, no, no, we're not, we're not leaving yet. We need more items for stealing purposes. Uh, bandit hand, bandit hand, chain, stealing hand. Okay, that should be fine. Alright, we're gonna go check out the alternate netherworld now. I know it's near the end of the episode and we should probably not do this at this point, but we're going to. Uh, okay. 35. Oh gosh, what is this? Oh, God. This is not what I was expecting. Okay, that's fine. Oh, did I kill somebody else that was hiding? I guess so. Um, uh, sure, why not kill you over there, buddy? Get on over there and do some damage. Oh, yeah, we can't do that here, can we? Hmm. Not a fan. Alright, whatever, we'll just attack. It's fine. 
All right, what else we got? Arzla, no. Um, Antros, yes, but let's get somebody else to throw you. I think Gordon could probably do some good throwing here. Oh, that's actually a place you can land. Sweet. Okay. Is that a bomb right next to me? I feel like that's a bomb. I'm gonna blow it up. I didn't blow it up. It's fine. Alright, let's see what happens. There should be a lot of counterattacks and all that stuff. I'm pretty confident that we are going to be fine. Yep. Yeah, it's, it's fine. Antros up here now. Put him there, have him big bang. Okay, what else we got? Uh, don't be sure. Pick you up, throw you over here. Pick him up, throw him over here. Have him attack. Execute. And I guess Planair is probably going to be the one to take care of the guy that's over here, maybe? I don't know, my voice gets so high sometimes, but it does, it's fine. Alright, and that's not everyone. I'm also going to need someone else. Probably Throwbot. And... I don't know, Arzla, I guess. Alright, Throwbot. Let's go. Let's get this done. Alright, that should pretty much do it, except for the guy that Planair couldn't quite kill. Hey, hey, he lived. That was impressive. Okay. Planair, please finish them with your... your you have a soggy drop, it's fine. And... Uh, oh no! Oh, he didn't live. I thought he lived. I thought Captain Gordon lived. He did not. I was mistaken. Alright, well that was really strange. I don't think I like that very much, but that's fine. Anyway, we'll continue down all that stuff in the next episode. Hope you guys enjoyed, and uh, yeah, hope you're looking forward to seeing some of those bigger, scarier fights go our way, hopefully. And yeah, yeah, we'll, we'll see. All right, folks, until the very next episode, I am Bumpy McSquiggums. Thank you so much for stopping by The Freak Show, and I will see you later. <laughs> <laughs>